For miles along a stretch of Highway 21 in central Texas, there's a wasteland. In the past 20 years, local pecan growers and ranchers have watched hundreds of trees slowly die. Harvey Hayek's family has harvested pecans for several generations. Recently, he's watched his grove production dwindle by tens of thousands. Uh, as time went on again, more and more trees started dying at a time. And we just got where, uh, in some years here, uh, we, we didn't harvest one pound of pecans out of all of these uh, trees. Environmentalists believe the culprit is a coal-fired power plant nearby. The Fayette Power Project has three boilers, and only one has a device to decrease sulfur dioxide emissions. It's been that way for 30 years. Scientists have gradually collected evidence that shows sulfur dioxide pollution kills vegetation. It looked uh, just a, a total devastation to his pecan orchard, and he's only a few miles away from the power plant. And I know that sulfur dioxide from a power plant like Fayette can uh, have local effects. The plant's operator and the state environmental regulator deny the link between sulfur dioxide pollution and the dying trees. The Lower Colorado River Authority operates the Fayette plant and says it has invested millions of dollars in scrubbers to decrease SO2 pollution. We have added scrubbers on units one and two, which are co-owned by the Lower Colorado River Authority and Austin Energy. Unit three, which is solely owned by the Lower Colorado River Authority, has a built-in scrubber. When everything is, is together and is working, we will, those scrubbers will then remove about 90% of the sulfur dioxide. Local pecan growers may be the hardest hit because environmentalists say the trees are very sensitive to SO2. But Texas ranchers say orchards and trees of all varieties are dying from SO2 emissions across the state. The damage has also caught the attention of the EPA. They're now investigating the connection between the environment and the plant's SO2 pollution. Federal legal action hasn't been taken so far, but the agency's civil division has been asked to review the matter. Rich Matthews, The Associated Press.